I'm at Jasper's in the Shops of Legacy that is on the southeast corner of Legacy Drive and the Dallas North Tollway. I'm at the very south end of the Shops of Legacy. In fact, uh, the, the next thing you see is the Marriott Hotel. So if you come to the Marriott Hotel, you know you're at Jasper's. And I have the privilege of being with Kent Rathbun, who is the owner of Jasper's. And Kent, what a pleasure to see you today. Well, thank you for coming out and uh, taking a little interest in Jasper's restaurant. Well, ja you know, Kent, the, the interesting thing about you, you've forgotten more than most <laughs> restaurant tours in the Dallas could ever think about. And you know, it's, it's flattering that you say that because I use that statement a couple of times in my life. So I had I, one of my first chefs that taught me how to cook used to use that. I forgot more about cooking than you'll ever know. <laughs> well, tell me, what are you trying to do here at Jasper's? So, you know, Jasper's is sort of a restaurant that uh, encompasses uh, beautiful food, but things that are very approachable. I grew up in Kansas City with a dad and a mother who cooked great outdoor cooking. So we smoked meats, we grilled meats, we grilled fish, we did rotisserie over the wood. So Jasper's has a tagline of gourmet backyard cuisine, and it's all about the wood grill. And we burn a, we burn a hickory and oak grill here, and we cook great steaks, beautiful fish, everything's from scratch here at Jasper's. We make some great desserts, fantastic salads and appetizers, but the meats and fish off the grill are, big, are the big thing. And so we have a beautiful patio, we got a great bar in here, I mean the patio is awesome in the spring, a beautiful time to your beautiful place to go out and hang out uh, but the, the kitchen is an open kitchen so you kind of get the feel of what's going on with the fire and the, and the grill we also have a wood-burning oven which we do lots of flatbreads and pizzas and things like that in there and Jasper's is a place where you can really come and just really enjoy some casual food that is really off the chain wonderful and it's it's food that's done with the chef's expertise and and tell me uh, you do have uh, private dining here do you not we do have private dining. In fact, we have two spaces. Actually, we have three spaces. One is the boardroom, and uh, we seat uh, anywhere from 12 to 14 in the boardroom. We have a private dining room in the back that seats up to 50. And then we have the picnic area, which is semi-private. It's got some, uh, some cool little curtains that pull, but it's not completely private. But we have lots of private dining going on in there as well. So uh, the boardroom and uh, the PDR have uh, capabilities for all internet connections and AV and all that kind of thing. It's a great place to have a private party or a business meeting. I love the way the bar, the way you've designed the restaurant, the bar, it's, it's, it's like walking into someone's home, it's just all open and you can, you know, you, you get the feel when you come in, you can just sit back and watch a sports event or whatever and it, it's, it's just, it, the experience is unbelievable. Tell me a little bit more about the bar. Well the bar is a, is a watching experience. Sports maybe, people maybe. <laughs> I mean, you see a lot of cool people in this bar for sure. We have a nice lounge, we got some stand-up tables, then we have the bar itself. It's a beautiful back bar, we've got lots of TVs, lots of activity. It's a great place to come and have a drink for happy hour or even just hang out through the evening or late night as well. It's a great time. Would you cook us some something back in the kitchen while you're here? I know this is a this is a treat for us to be here and to to be with you. And I don't want to impose on you. Would you mind doing that? No, of course. We're going to cook some of our favorites. We're going to do a sautéed scallop dish, and then we're going to do a couple things off the grill. Let's go to the kitchen. Let's do it. I'm glad I came back in the kitchen with you, Kent, because I see you're going to cook uh, some scallops. You're going to cook a steak. Tell us what you're doing here. So this is a really good example of another dish that comes uh, from our kitchen here at Jasper's. This is our pan-seared sea scallops. We buy all of our scallops from the northeast up in Boston, and these are pan-seared with a really large shrimp, served on top of yellow curry sauce with a little bit of forbidden black rice. <laughs> forbidden black rice. Uh, beautiful dish. This is a great example of a dish that comes from Jasper's. Okay, so this ribeye steak, this is what Jasper's is all about. This is the gourmet backyard cuisine that we talk about. This is a ribeye steak, cowboy ribeye in fact. It's cooked on wood. We use oak and hickory. And I have to tell you, steakhouse is all over Dallas. I'll put this up against any steak in Dallas. We serve it with our house steak sauce, which is a reduction of port wine and balsamic vinegar, touch of butter, beautiful. Uh, fresh vegetables are a really awesome uh, loaded baked potato baked potato whatever you like it's a great choice and this is Jasper's the flatbread comes out of our wood burning oven and this is another signature dish here at Jasper's this is a focaccia roll with three cheeses it's got parmesan goat cheese and a little bit of mozzarella 
sauteed mushrooms and caramelized onions, and it is not to be missed. This is one of the signature dishes at Jasper's. You know, your kitchen is fabulous. You walk in here, not only do you have the warmth of the restaurant, everything blends together, Kent. You feel like you're in an open living room, you know, with the, with, with the dining area here, you've got your bar over here, but the kitchen open where people can see how clean it is, how you prepare everything. Nothing quite like this, really, the way you've got it designed. And I want you to speak about that, uh, uh, about your grill, because people, you know, out, people don't always understand about what you said about a non-gas grill. We know uh, there's a lot of steakhouses here in Dallas, and there's a lot of good ones. And I'm, I'm telling you, I eat in those steakhouses too. Most of those steakhouses are cooking on infrared broilers, which is a gas grill. does a great job. But I think what we have here at Jasper's, we're using all the same meats, we're seasoning well, and we're cooking over wood. And we use a combination of oak and hickory, and i got to tell you, I think it makes one of those flavors that you cannot get without burning logs in the fireplace. And so a steak at Jasper's is as good as it gets here in Dallas, Texas. What a spectacular place. What are your hours before we go? We open at 11 o'clock every morning. We do Sunday brunch on Sundays and also Saturday for that matter. And uh, we stay open until people, uh, you know, got to get kicked out. So come and have a good time. What a privilege to be here. Thank you so much for coming. This is such a busy time of the year. You're just a, uh, just a prince for doing this. And uh, we look forward to joining you at Jasper's. Thank you so much.